absolutely comes down to the fact that we absolutely cannot be here, then all we ask in exchange is help us find somewhere else that we can legally be at. Even if it's like they did with the Plum Street Village and they buy a small little property for people to park their RVs in. Like, or just even an unused parking lot somewhere. This place isn't, in, isn't like a business anymore, so we own the property, so let's move them out there. We're okay with that. We just want somewhere where we know we're not gonna have to worry every day of, about whether somebody's gonna come down and tell us we gotta move or not. It's about stability. Uh, in order for me to try to get my life back on track right now, I got a chapter 13 bankruptcy going on, trying to get rid of all my debt so that I can start over again. And with that on your record, nobody, you know, bankruptcy. You know how that affects people, you know. So it's, we're kind of stuck. You see your mom is in a wheelchair. Can you describe some of the uh, medical challenges? She has fibromyalgia. Um, her hip bones and her pelvic bone are literally dissolving into nothing. She has to wait for her A1C to go down to six or below so she can get approved for a hip transplant. In the meantime, she just has to trudge along all that she can do. So right now, we've got, so the 27th is the, the date for, uh, for folks to clear out of here. Um, and that time, so we've set up today as being a day for, for our social services to come out. Right now, we started with the Familiar Face and uh, Ambassadors Program. Uh, next week, on the 21st, I'm going to do the same thing, set up tents, um, have coffee available for folks to kind of just make it a little bit more you know, less harsh of a, of a reality of what's happening. So um, I'll have more, hopefully more social services out here. Uh, we're going to do the same kind of check-in about IDs, um, driver's licenses, see where they're at uh, in the process. And uh, they also need make sure that we didn't, because I know we didn't get to everybody out here today. So I want to make sure that we at least get to talk with them.